sounds are basically just vibrating molecules. These vibrations travel through the air, the bones and the fluid of our ear before getting converted into signals that can be processed and interpreted by our brains. A key step in the process of hearing involves so-called hair cells firing when the bits of membrane that they're attached to vibrates. People with hearing loss have a reduced number of these hair cells, which makes it more difficult for them to extract the information they care about from background noises. To solve this, what we want to do is amplify those sounds that are important so that the remaining undamaged hair cells can do a better job. The sound amplifier app has taken thousands of samples of sound and blended those together using machine learning to figure out what the best way is to present sound to someone who has a hearing impairment with very, very simple controls. Yeah, so I think you should come next year. I've been wearing hearing aids since I was 13. The world is a world of sound. Our interactions as human beings are very deeply dependent on our ability to have conversations. And without access to sound, it's very hard to do that. But if you think for just a moment about the several billion people who have smartphones running Android, all of those people could run sound amplifier. So in a sense, this is a wonderful way of distributing capability to millions of people.